know High School Musical is my absolute favorite movie of all time, and our next guest is a real life Troy Bolton. Brandon Moore always loved sports, even played football at the University of Alabama under coach Nick Saban. And while you won't see him on TV under stadium lights anymore, you can still watch the athlete turned actor in projects like Law and Order. And here to chat more about his whirlwind career is Brandon Moore himself. Brandon, I feel like you are living every kid's dream, man. I mean, you played college <laughs> ball at one of the best schools in the country. You're now a TV actor. How did this all happened for you sure uh first of all thank you guys for having me on um but as a kid i was always the kid with the like my parents got us the vhs recorder right you know and we were making the home movies and uh but then i was also going to football practice and you know just i love both sides i've always loved art and every every way i paint and um sing and do all that stuff so i i definitely enjoyed both so i'm just a dreamer at the end of the day so right. i just kept chasing every dream i had and uh, just, you know, thankfully the Lord had a, a plan that included my dreams. So mm, absolutely. Just, you know, I'm very thankful. Mm, so grateful to just hear how he's guided your steps and put you where you are now. I hear coach too uh, was a big part in kind of encouraging you to take on this acting career. Tell us more just about your time playing at Alabama and your friendship with Saban. Absolutely. So our coach Saban, I, I tell everybody, he's made me a man. You know, I came in as this kid out of high school, thought I was the man, you know, and, and had to become one there as he always does he always tends to like you know break us down to rebuild us and not in a disrespectful way but just like kind of unearths all the things that we need to work on as men and um you know discipline effort you know the toughness to push through the hard times um i think that there's nothing that could have prepared me more for the film industry uh, you know like that man right there coach saban uh getting up early doing what you you know don't want to necessarily do so that you can have the time on the field or on the screen now and um just to respect everyone as if, you know, the CEO to the janitor, it's the same, you know, we're all humans and it's just been a great time on set. You have grips all the way to the director and you can treat everybody however you want. And um, he's always taught me to just choose kindness because it's free, you know? Yeah, yeah, so interesting to hear uh, just from your perspective how those worlds kind of parallel. And like you said, you know, kindness certainly one of the most important things. And, you know, fast forward to now, your acting career, thriving, your big Law & Order episode aired just last week right here on WFF48, actually. What was that like for you, you know, <laughs> seeing yourself on the screen and also, you know, kind of behind the scenes, tell us a little bit about the character that you play. Absolutely. So my, my name on that show is Jesse Erickson. Um, he was a high school kid that was, you know, going to, you know, take a leap year to go help in, uh, I think it was Nigeria to build a school. Like he was just a good kid, um, athlete as well. Um, and just got kind of caught up in, you know, the wrong, wrong crowd for a second and uh, made some bad decisions. And in case anybody hasn't seen it, it's just, you know, I have to fight for, you know, my life on the stand um, and really plead my heart. And that is a, a blessing because, you know, a lot of times we don't get an opportunity, especially as athletes with the way I look mm -hmm. to, to really break down. I usually play like the cop or the, the, the you know, athlete or the high school boyfriend or, or something like that, you know, is able to maybe show a little chops, you know, that people maybe thought I didn't have. So yeah. it was a blessing for sure. Uh, well, Brandon, huge congratulations again on the role. We'll say that that episode again premiered on WFF last week, but you can certainly check it out on other streaming platforms. Um, with that, Brandon, too, I mean, what's next for you? Any other projects right now in the works? Absolutely. Um, so we have a few things that are, are pinned, but we have NDA signed, so I can't really talk about what's okay. coming on, like shooting. But we do have uh, Mayor of Kingstown that airs this Sunday um, on Paramount Plus. That's not really a family friendly show, if I'm just going to be honest, but <laughs> I, you know, put it out God. there. Um, yeah. And then uh, there's a movie called Condor's Nest that is a um, military film, uh, World War II kind of, you know, and I speak German in that. That'll be in theaters the 28th. Um, yeah, and we have another Lifetime movie, A and E movie, coming out called Broken Ties. So for all the Lifetime fans out there that uh, enjoy that, like my mom, uh, so it, it's you know a few things coming. But I'm thankful. Well, we are so excited and just hyped for you, Brandon. Thank you again so much, and just to you know a huge congratulations on your career, and just to hear you know even talk about uh, your light for the Lord and in the kingdom and all this. We know Hollywood can be a, a crazy industry, so thank you for that as well. Recap for us again, if you will, um, just where our viewers can maybe keep up with you. I think you're on social media is right we know you are certainly uh, going far and this is just the beginning so where can we keep up absolutely um my instagram is brandon tyler moore like mary tyler moore for um, my younger generation might not know that but uh, then facebook i think it's brandon moore ua um and then twitter it's it's just be more if right. you'd like to follow me on twitter we'll be on the instagram list. is my main Bye. perfect well brandon thank we're you. your biggest fans thank you again so much and just huge Appreciate congratulations it. can't wait to see where else all you go thanks thank you guys so much thanks.